Hello everyone, welcome back to CVR. Um, I'm going to be explaining real quick a feature that you can use to help us basically fix issues without you even needing to report them. Um, so, let's get right into it, shall we? Alright, hello. I am in the... I'm here in the new 1.7.0 update, and one of the things we've introduced in this update is a brand new system called Automatic Error Reporting. So this is fairly self-explanatory from the name. Um, it's a system we've implemented that lets us fix issues without you needing to specifically go in and submit a bug report. So today I'm going to be showing you how to enable it. So first, you're going to go into your watch. You do need to be on the new UI for this. If you don't know how to do that, you can go to the settings of your user interface and enable and disable use legacy UI, and you'll have this brand new UI that we've been working on. Now, to enable automatic error reporting, you're going to want to go to settings. Then you're going to want to go over, and you'll see automatic error reporting, AER. Automatic error reporting is a system which blah, 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 blah. So to enable this, you can press enable. It'll give you a little warning so you can understand the privacy implications. And then you press yes, and you'll see successfully enabled. Then when you turn on AER, you'll have another checkbox over here, which is allow AER contact. So this is an optional thing that adds your um, your user ID along with your automatic error reports, which again, you can read up on a bit more here. Um, which basically gives us the it gives us the it permits us to contact you about reports your game makes automatically. So for example, if you're having a recurring issue and you haven't felt like making a bug report, but it, it's been sending us a lot of reports, then it will let us ask you questions about what you were doing at the time because it doesn't give us too much context for privacy reasons. So you can enable that, and you can see it'll say enabled AER contact, and then you can see it says it doesn't attempt to anonymize it anymore. So that's something to keep in mind. This is an attempt to anonymize. It isn't 100% foolproof, but as it says here, it's encrypted, so only we can access it. And if you ever want to opt out of that, you can disable it. And if you want to stop doing AER entirely for privacy reasons or whatever you, whatever you feel necessary, you can simply press this button. It's one click, and it's done. So thanks for thanks in advance. If you do decide to enable this, it really helps us improve CVR, and we hope to see you again soon.